Hey, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be bringing you guys a Dauntless inspired makeup tutorial from the Divergent series. Before filming this tutorial, I've already applied my brows as well as my foundation, so all I'm doing now is just taking an eyeshadow primer and running it over my eyelids. In the next parts, I'm going to be speeding everything up because this is one of the easiest smoky eyes I know. All I'm doing now is just taking a regular eyeliner and running it on the outer corners of my eyes and you have about maybe 10 to 15 seconds to blend it in with your fingers before it sets. It doesn't have to be perfect, this is just to give a dark face to the shadows that I'm going to be placing on top. In this next step, I'm just going to be using one of my favorite palettes to bring on the road with me and just going to be taking a medium matte brown color and just blending this lightly into my crease line. I'm not using a heavy hand because this is just a transition shade to soften up the look a bit. Up next, I'll just be using a matte black shadow to go over where I placed all of that black eyeliner to fade in a eye line as well as extend the line up more to give a little bit more intensity. I'm going to be taking what's left underneath the brush and going underneath my eyes just to make this look a little more smoky and hazy. For this tutorial, I'm blending the black shadow well above the crease line, but you can definitely bring it down back into the crease for an everyday eye. Up next, I'll just be using the same eyeliner that I used in the beginning and going and filling in my waterline as well as making a definite line as close to the lash line I can get it. Um, I'm not doing so much of a wing on the end, it's just to bring a little bit more intensity. Up next, I'm going to be taking a shimmery beige color. This won't be going over my entire lid, but I will be using it in the corners of my eyes just to bring a little bit more contrast to the look. After finishing this step, I'm just going to be putting on some falsies off camera. Next, I'm going to be taking one of my favorite highlighters by My Beauty Addiction and just buffing that onto the high points of my cheeks. To finish everything off, I will be using Jessie's Girls Glow Stick Lip Gloss in the color Red Dawn on my lips. Now this is a more subtle neutral option, but I couldn't let you guys leave without giving you a second option. For this I'll just be using a deep cranberry lip liner, going along the outer corners of my lips, rubbing until it's blended in and my lips are completely coated, and then topping everything off with a deep berry lip gloss. I hope that you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Stay tuned for a video featuring everyone in the collab. 